What's going on, everybody? I believe this is a Monday video. Marvelous Monday. Welcome back to work Monday type deal. So, another blunder. This time by Tops. This should be triple threads. What we consider the white whale, the case hits out there. As you can kind of see, I know it's probably a little bit harder to see. I'll post this probably in the community board if I remember. If not, somebody email me. You guys can see the full picture. But this is the white whales. One is of Dave Winfield, one's of David Wright, but their sticker autos are swapped. So you got Wright's on Winfield, Winfield on Wright's card. Now, just by looking at this, it's the same owner has both of these, so that's kudos to him offhand. So, you know, he can do with what he wants. But I, I just have so many issues right now with the QC part of this stuff coming across. I know some people are like, oh, you're nitpicking, you know. But I'm really, I guess you could say in a way I am, but my problem is... If I'm going out buying Dynasty, Definitive, Diamond Icons, the bigger stuff, and I'm getting these blunders, it shouldn't be happening. And not as frequent as they are. I mean, you're giving somebody to put stickers in the car and they have no idea what the autographs are. I mean, they should be labeled. I mean, it, it can't be rocket scientists or rocket science on this. And they're making it look very, very bad overall to the collectors out there on this stuff. It, it just upsets me and infuriates me because, you know, just look at the Babe Ruth cut auto. What if I was the one who pulled that out of uh, Dynasty and, you know, it had George Brett on it? The amount of time to get that stuff back could take a year. A year plus. I mean, look at Panini on replacements. Ridiculous. I mean, maybe something high profile, you know, gets done because it's in the eye of social media. But when you're sitting here looking at, like, tops, I know it gets mailed to a different area in Pennsylvania and stuff. My fear is that they're like, oh, well, yeah, we couldn't do nothing with it. We don't have these da-da-da-da stuff like that there to be able to replace it and stuff. Here's a couple packs of top series one. That'd be my luck. I'm not saying they will do that, but that'd be my luck in what I get back. But I thought I'd share this because we've been tearing apart Panini on a lot of the blunders here recently. And nobody's safe out there onto it. It's just that the... Quality control is just getting worse and worse. And it makes me second guess buying into some of my favorite high end products, especially tops, because I just don't want to deal with the drama and the mess of pulling something, having to use social media to blow it up just so it gets taken care of in a proper time frame. All right, enough of me jibber jabbering on here. Guys, I'm out. Appreciate it as always. See you next one.